dears and welcome back well my dears now that it's not vlogmas anymore what am i gonna call you guys anyways wilder and i are on the way to check on the new baby this is like a last minute thing because i got like a text reminder saying that i had an appointment today and i guess I thought my appointment was tomorrow and I don't know why but I scheduled this appointment right around Wilder's nap time also so I hope that he is not grumpy. I feel like we only have like one more appointment, no two more appointments to go to until the new baby which is crazy. But yeah anyways I just figured I would take you guys along with us of course. We normally do whenever we go to appointments like this. Now for the fun part, getting Wilder out of the car and getting everything ready to go. This is really difficult um, being pregnant. I don't know why, it's just really hard to do things. Okay, so we are on the way in. I'm sorry if you guys can't really hear me. The wind is picking up. Huh, it's super windy. But we're on the way into the appointment. I tell you this every time, Judy, but you are heavy. Yeah. How about you? Are you gonna be good? I know you're super tired. Let's find the restroom. Mommy's gotta go potty. Really quickly, look at Wilder's outfit. It is literally the cutest thing. Can you show him? You wanna show him? Yeah. Yeah, you look super cute. His shirt says dude, because that's literally all we call him is dude. So it fits him all on the side, it says dude. It's the cutest thing ever. Come on, dude, let's go. Come on. Of course we get on the wrong floor, and we, we go to the wrong place. Of course we do. This place is like a maze, I don't know why. me daddy just as much as me we got your water we got a big boy a big boy everyone in the doctor's office always says how cute he is just like you know all babies are cute but they always call him a little ham and I think it's so funny because he literally is he's just he's so chunky he's a little ham You're my little ham so we made it out and they were gonna have me do this like <clears throat> test where they like swab your vaginal area and your anus area, that's what they do. Like um, the last part of your pregnancy, even though I'm having a C-section, they still wanted to do it. And thankfully they said we could wait until next time so I could have Garrick there with me to help me with Wilder while they did that test. Because otherwise it just would not have been good because Wilder is in that stranger danger phase so if somebody were to like help me out I'm sure he would have freaked out so I'm glad I can do that next time and we didn't have to do that this time so I got out of there pretty quickly and now I think I'm gonna go meet Garrick hopefully because I want to see him I'm super out of breath because that I don't know why it just <coughs> it's a whole ordeal going to these appointments because I'm so pregnant now and I have no energy and I just get so winded so easily. And especially carrying him around. Oh God, and don't even get me started if he's fussy. Thank God he did good, he was a good boy. I'm sure he'll sleep on the way home because he is tired and I'm tired, I need a nap. Baby just went to sleep. So Wilder is sleeping, Garrick's bummed because he he doesn't want to wake him up and he wanted to see him mm. I love you love you see you later love 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 love, love. 
Garrick had to go back to work and I hate it. I just wish he could be home with me all the time. I always miss him so much. That sounds so cheesy, but I do. And I just wish that we got more time together and Wilder got more time. He was also really sad because Wilder fell asleep before, like literally right before we got there. So he didn't want to wake him up. So he was kind of upset that he didn't get to see him, even though he'll see him when he gets home still he just works a lot and <clears throat> I'm so proud of him for the work, work ethic that he has but it really does suck being away from him all the time and yeah it just sucks anyways Wilder is still sleeping we're on the way home now the seatbelt is really freaking hurting me so I like put it behind me it's like it's super uncomfortable I'm having contractions right now and really hurts. So Garrick is having me go back and meet him because he only has a few more things to do. So I guess I'm just going to ride with him and so he can see Wilder. Now I'm a happy gal and I am about to pull up. Wilder is still sleeping so when he wakes up he will see his dad dad and be super happy. We've been riding around with Garrick and I still am having contractions pretty bad. I don't know if it's because I've just been sitting for a while or or what but they're getting really strong Garrick's getting gas right now and then we are finally headed home and I think I'm going to take a hot bath and so hopefully my contractions will stop my belly is super tight and I'm having like contractions but I can't really time them because I just feel like it's always happening, but they're not really that intense, so I'm not that worried about it, but it is really uncomfortable. Also, my back is really killing me. And this happened with Wilder, too. I had really bad back contractions. Give me those chips. Wow, okay, so you're not gonna share? Can I have this chip? Oh, I can't even have that chip, huh? <laughs> Are you serious? He's always in the shower, I'm about to cook dinner. Wilder is running amok. Hey, not those chips. Okay guys, so I just recently took a bath because like I was saying, I was having contractions really bad. Um, and they were pretty frequent. Now they're like, they're not frequent enough to go into the hospital or go to labor and delivery or anything, but they're definitely super, super uncomfortable and I'm having like really, really awful back pain. This is the only way I'm comfortable right now is just like squished on a body pillow. But yeah, Wilder is now sleeping. I took a really long warm bath and that kind of helped. And then Whenever I got out, it just felt the same though. This this is the exact thing that happened with Wilder, except I remember being in a lot more pain. Um, Garrick says it was probably like the last two weeks of my pregnancy, which is kind of where I'm at right now. So I'm just really hoping that like, I don't go another two to three weeks. Well, three weeks. My C-section is scheduled three weeks from now, so I'm hoping I don't have to go another three weeks feeling like this because that would be awful. Keep it crisp. Oh my God. Keep it crazy. <laughs> Anyways, I think I'm going to try to get some sleep. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel if you have not already. Click that little notification bell right here. On my foreface. So you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. Like always, thank you guys so much for watching and being a part of our family. We love you so much and we can't say keep it Christmas anymore, but we'll see you in the next vlog. Boom!